Today I'm going to speak about the price list. In order to activate the price list, you need to go to the settings, sales, and here customer feature, use price list to adapt your price per custom. You have to apply and now you can use price lists. So let's start. I'm going to sales. In the bottom of the sales on the configuration, I have price lists. And take my black valid. I will edit the price and put 100 euro. It's the easiest for us to make the calculation. So the black valid is 100 euro. To check if the price is correct, I can create a sales order. Mary Marlowe. I add the item black wallet and you see here the price is 100 euros so everything is absolutely perfect. When I create a sales order you see here the price list. In standard it comes with the public price list. In my case, it's in Euro. If I look at the black wallet, with the standard price list, the black wallet has the price of 100 Euro. I want to change this price because Mary Marlowe is a distributor and I want to give her a 40% reduction. First of all, I will have to create a price list for Marlowe. I will go into configuration, price list, price list. And I create a new price list which I will give the name of Marlowe. To simplify, I always save immediately. Next element I will need is a so-called price list version. It means specifically for a period all the rules related to the price calculation. For this, I click on edit and I can add an item here. I click add item. This item is in my case fall. It will start on the 1st of October and be valid until the end of November. I can save and close it. So you see the price list Marlow needs to be active and the price list version full needs to be active, otherwise it will not work. Let's go into the detail of the full price list. I can add a sequence. Let me add an item. The first thing I want to do is I want to have the black wallet with a 40% reduction. In this case, I will just select the product Black Wallet Normally I will have the tendency to have the rule name exactly the same as the name of the product so that I can find it easier. I can indicate the minimum quantity for the validity of this rule and I can indicate the sequence. The system is going to search in the sequence order all the conditions until he finds the very first one that is valid and that he can apply. Now, how would I calculate the 40% reduction for Mari Marlowe? In this case, I want the price computation to be based on the public price. The public price is 100 euro, so I want to have a reduction and the end price should be 60 euro. There are multiple ways to get here. The first thing is to say here, give me a reduction of 40%. I can type in minus 0 0.4, save and close. I will save the result 
and let us try if this works. I jump to the sales order. I'll discard this first sales order that I have created and start to create a new one. Mari Marlowe. Here you see the, the price list is the public price list. I can change this price list to Marlowe. But this is not very practical because I need to think every time, oh, I need to change the price list. For this reason, you can just click on the button on the right to the name and directly into Sales and Purchases, you can indicate what is the default sales price list for this customer. In this case, I will change the public price list to Marlowe so that I don't have to change it anymore. Of course, it will not activate it automatically for the quotation or the sales order I'm entering. But whenever next time I create a sales order, the system should automatically come with the prices. Let's try it. So I'm going to discard this and create it again. So Mari Marlowe. And you see here the price list has come automatically with the Marlowe price list. Great feature. So now the product is the black wallet. I select the black wallet and the unit price comes with 60 euro. You remember that we had said that we wanted a reduction of 40%. So as you see, the system is perfectly working. You may have the situation where instead of having a price reduction of 60%, uh, you have a fixed price. How can you handle this fixed price? It's something quite easy to do. Let me go back to my black wallet. I can click on the black wallet here and change the rule. So now, Instead of saying I have a reduction of 40%, I want to say I have a fixed price of 45 euro. In order to have the fixed price, I need to enter minus 1 here. As you see, I have the base price multiplied with 1 minus 1, so I can enter the fixed price on the right side. I save it. Let's see if it works. I add an item and enter a black wallet. And you see immediately the price comes with 45. Okay. The system will not change an already existing position based on the new rule that I have created. It will just be active on new positions. So normally you should have the price list managed before you start creating sales order. In our case, we are just demonstrating how the system works. The next situation I would like to show you is to have another criteria for the price calculation. I want to make a reduction for all goods of 20%. In this case, I will choose the product category goods and say here that I want a reduction of 20%, 0 0.2. 0 .2. Here I will have a sequence of 10. Save and close. And you see here now I have two conditions. The first condition is the black wallet with a price of 45 euro and the goods reduction with the price uh, with a reduction of 20%. 
let me save this. Yes, I would like first to check the product to make sure that the product belongs to the pro proper category. So I will just go very quickly on the product. Here I have a black wallet. And under accounting, the internal category is not the proper one. Let me assign this to the category called goods. So now it is assigned to the proper category. I can go back to my sales order. I create a sales order for Marie Marlowe. The price list comes correctly. Now I add the product black wallet. Oh, what happens? The building price is 45 euro. It means that it did not take into account the change I did. There is a reason for this. And I'm going to explain this immediately to you. When I go to the price list, The sequence is 5 for black wallet, where I had a price of 45 euro, and 10 for the goods reduction, where I have my 20% reduction. The system first found this condition and applied it. He never had the opportunity to go to the next condition. In this case, I need to edit my sequences. So I'm going to check and change the sequence of the black wallet from 5 to 20. I can save it and go back to my sales order. I choose my Make wallet, and you see, immediately the unit price is 80 euro. I can save my order now. What happens if you want to have a price list in another currency? When you create the price list, the system will ask you the currency. In this case here, you don't see the currency because I have not activated the multi-currency in my system. So, I will first activate the multi-currency. I go to Accounting and Accounting and Finance allow multi-currency. I go back to the Sales price list here and now I can create a price list. First of all you may have seen now when I show the price list I have a currency appearing here. It was not necessary before because there was only the euro as a currency so it's only necessary if you use a multi-currency system. Now I create the price list for the Swiss customers. I call this Swiss price list and I can change the currency to CHF. Everything else is going to be the same, but the system will know that this price is in Swiss, in Swiss francs. Well, that's it for today. If you want to have a look at Odoo, visit our webpage demosas.ybioservices.net.